Snack Town with Big Nick. Today I've got a guest here. Dave, thank you for joining us today. Very welcome. Today we are having unique snacks. We've got six different flavors. Want to shout them out for sending this to us to try on the show. We greatly appreciate you. Let's get to eating, I guess. Yeah. First one we're going to try is we're going to try the original Splits pretzels. Are you a pretzel guy? I do love pretzels. Wow, these are big pretzels. I mean, oh, like, yeah, that's, that's a big, no, that's big pretzel. We're compared to like a rolled gold? Yeah. Wow, that's good shit. Really? That's good shit. Mm. That's good shit. That's pretty good. I'm a fan of that. I'm good shit. I think these are pretty dark for pretzels, and these one of the other dark. one of the other flavors is like extra dark. So those are gonna be like burnt. Supposedly there's only five ingredients in this. Unbleached wheat flour, sunflower oil, salt, shocker, soda, and yeast. How often do you actually know what all the things are on the ingredient list? I really prefer things that have maltodextrin by <laughs> Big maltodextrin guy? Yeah. I'm giving these an eight. I like these. These are no. pretty good. I'm going with seven. Now we got extra salt. Extra salt, salt for salt lovers. You ain't shit with a lot of salt on this. When Jeez, I have like please. a when I have like a super pretzel. I always put like a fuck ton of salt on it, you know? These are pretty good though. I like it better this way. Well, oh, good. Apparently I'm a salt lover. Oh, I have no problem with that I'm a salt lover. I love my salt. I love my sugar. I mean, I'm gonna have another one. I'm gonna give this a nice. You're gonna try it yourself. Oh, yeah. These are fucking good. You know who would love that is uh, a salt lover. Um, you know that's who, so true. Do you, do you know who wouldn't love it? Is a non-salt lover. That's and, uh, also so true. <laughs> <laughs> Two great this is why people watch Snack Time for our analysis. This is, yeah, <laughs> this is we the, make it clear. I'm gonna get those nine as well. I might need some water for this for this snack time. Oh. You know what I'm gonna get? I'm gonna get a Capri Sun in the fridge. Right oh, now. I'll have oh. one with you. Uh, right um, Where are they gone? I don't know if they're in the fridge. You bastard. <laughs> no, no. Now we still got some. You got right. two. We got exactly two. Look at that, two. two. Look at that. You want passion fruit mango or strawberry kiwi? Whatever one, I don't care. This is multi-grain. Okay. Uh, sounds yeah. healthier. It looks healthier. Not enough salt. I mean, it's not bad. I wouldn't enjoy having them like those. I think I like it better than the original. You know, it's got the little pieces in it, so it's like a little extra crunch in there. I'm gonna go with yeah. I'm giving it an eight. Extra dark. These are the well done. No. Oh shit. Extra dark bolded chard. Oh, these are burnt. Look how dark, dark, oh, dark oh, man. Look how dark that is. I don't know how I feel about that. This is dark. It's better than I thought it would be. It's better than I thought it would be. Not doing it for me. That's just a burnt pretzel. I'm gonna go five. Are these from a specific state or something? I'm sure they're from a state. <laughs> I think I gotta hold my juice box. Chug it, chug it, chug, chug it. Chug it now. I'm giving the extra dark. A six, I guess. Sourdough craft beer pretzel rings. Ooh. I'm already into this. I'm a sourdough man. Wow. Look at onion ring. They're still oh, huge. huge. I thought they were going to be smaller. Look at that. It's a monocle. They are really hard. Really hard. Definitely does taste different. Better? Who's this like? Oh, it's like that. That's what you do on the show. I'm going to go six. I wasn't a huge fan. I think I'm with you there. I wouldn't complain about it, but I wouldn't ask for it either. Soft pretzels are way better than any store-bought pretzels oh, you're going to get. Yeah. I mean, I go soft over hard any day of the week anyway. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> all right, all right, all right, already. This is the last one. This is the most unique one. No pun intended. <laughs> we got pretzel shells, dude. Hollow pretzel Interesting. sticks. Interesting. Pretzel shells, huh? Oh. <laughs> so it's just thing is, I already like these better because I can get them down. I'm giving those an eight. I'm curious what the serving size is on the other ones because it's 15 on this one. It's probably like two for the other one. You said, said eight. eight yeah. I'm also giving it an eight. I and didn't mind the pretzels. I can do without the burnt one and the multigrain one. Like I could have all those if like they're at a party or something. I can like, whatever. I feel like if you could dip them in some hummus or, Ooh, or something. Yeah. Yeah. These would be yeah. some good dipping ones. Cause mm -hmm. like they're also huge yeah. and they're dry. Right. Yeah. Yeah. You're not going to have to go on like a rescue mission. You know, you put a Tostito in the dip, it breaks off and you're like, well now I got to get another one to try to get that one out. If these pretzels are breaking in the dip that you're putting it in, you're probably dipping it in glue. So. <laughs> yeah. My favorite one was definitely the extra salt followed by Me the too. hollow. I had, I had the salt. Yeah, I would agree. So I'd go salt yeah. hollow original. Great. I think they'd be a good party snack. So that does it for this episode of Snack Time. Dave, thank you for joining me today. Of course. Make sure you put down in the comments below what you want us to try next. Till next time, that's a wrap.